Back on the level now then for a 12 furlong race. Mile and a half. And this is for four year olds. Look to the top one is Major Left for Alex Cherry. Mirage Higgins for Conrad Liggett. Funny Ben. David Hooley, Oceans of Aegis for Darren Thompson, Storm Murmur, David Robertson, Charming Man, Derek Hinton, Mix of Intrigue, Joshua Sutherland, The Incident, Leon Van Rensburg, Pal Mal, Martin Ledham, Houston Image, Vinnie Gerard, Yushindi Wen, Alex Cherry, Birthday Ripple, Conrad Liggett, Funny Sunny, David Hooley, Double Chest, Darren Thompson, Yushindi Kando for David Robertson, Love of My Life, and Obladi Oblada for Derek Hinton, who's also got Trial of Hollywood as well, Firth Zetkin for Craig Allen, Global Sale for Greg Allen as well, Tinker of Rye for Leon Van Rensburg, Gladiatrix for Martin Leedham, Pepper Tree Avenue and Priscilla Assertive for Pontypool Racing and Fremont Hopeful for Vinnie Gerrard. So, good big field again for this one, over a mile and a half, and away they go. And it's going to be Trail of Hollywood, it looks like he's going to go into the lead, and somehow Derek Hinton's managed to get four in this, so I don't know... Well, the two of them weren't supposed to be in, they're in the wrong race or what? But anyway, Trial of Hollywood is in the lead, and I think, as we said in the last race, poor old Derek Hinton's been last every race just about, so he's got four, and he's probably got four times as much chance of being last again, hasn't he? Anyway, Trial of Hollywood is in the lead, and has quickly gone five or six lengths clear. Of Storm Murmur is just in second. We have Firth Zek in there, spread right across the track. There could be one or two little hard luck stories on the turn when they go into the straight but we'll see what happens and Trail of Hollywood is clear and he's not going to be in the slightest bit concerned about any of that leading by a good six lengths right over on the far side mix of intrigue is the one widest that one might lose a bit of ground so too might global sailors on that one's inside but it's almost 12 in a line probably even more than that as they make their way down towards the final seven furlongs then and Train of Hollywood leads by a good seven lengths to Houston Image in second Global Sailors in third then Tinker of Rye for that one Pal Mouse close up so's Double Chest uh, looking towards the back Eric has got the leader under back three so it's Trail of Hollywood in the lead from Global Sail in second Tinker of Rye is next then Double Chest and Houston Image Oceans of Aegis is trying to get into it as well Pepper Tree Avenue is also well placed but it's Trail of Hollywood who continues to lead but only a couple now to Global Sail right over on the far side who's just about second coming through now though is Firth Zetkin and Firth Zetkin is now second but it's Trail of Hollywood who continues to lead coming down towards the final four furlongs and Trail of Hollywood is a couple of lengths clear of Pepper Tree Avenue on the inside then Tinker of Ryan Firth Zetkin double chest is still there as well Houston Image is also trying to get into it one or two wide on the track have lost a little bit of ground but not a great deal it's Trail of Hollywood still in the lead though three furlongs to go Trail of Hollywood by two to in second place now further Zek who looks like he's really throwing down his challenge Major Left has come from nowhere and looks to be running a big race Double Chest is there as well the four of them now in a line as they pass the two furlong pole and suddenly Trail of Hollywood is overtaken and it's Major Left who's in the lead Major Left Firth Zek in his second then comes Double Chest in third up the centre of the track Funny Sunny the incident trying to get into it as well there's only a furlong to go and it's Firth Zek on the near side Firth Zek in from Double Chest these two being chased by Funny Sunny and Pepper Tree Avenue well inside the final half furlong and double chest asserts and double chest pulls away to take it finishing like a train is Priscilla asserted but double chest wins it Priscilla asserted might have got to be second and I think Derek Hinton may have ended up with the last three but not quite the last four so there it is then double chest another one for Darren Thompson showed a good turn of foot also finishing like a train though Priscilla asserted didn't quite get up to be second but over another furlong, that one would surely have challenged the leader. So Double Chest takes it for Darren Thompson. Firth Zetkin for Craig Allen was second. Priscilla Asserti for Graham Clutterbuck was third. Tinker of Rye for Leon Van Rensburg fourth. And Oceans of Aegis for the winning trainer Darren Thompson was fifth.